Hi everyone, how's it going? My name is Alvin. My name is Suzu. And welcome back to Japa Peanut World. Whoosh. It's been a long time since we filmed the video. <laughs> we have been, you know, going through wedding, planning, all that stuff. So we really didn't have time to edit, film. It was just super busy. Yes, even after the wedding, we were very tired and I have so much issues in my body yeah. <laughs> that I have to deal with to recover. So our body was so used to not doing anything and mm -hmm. like that entire weekend was just like our bodies were like shocked at what we did. Mm -hmm. So for me, mm -hmm. I told everybody, but I felt like I was jet lagged. Yeah. It was so crazy. And like Suzu was out the entire week because her mom was here and mm -hmm. we wanted to show her a good time. So yeah, it was fun. Good Miss on. you, mama. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, today we're gonna go ahead and talk about the wedding. Yay, wedding! Do you guys wanna hear what happened behind the scenes? Yes! So as you probably see in the video that we posted recently, our wedding video actually. So our friend Ethan actually did the, the videography for it and he did the editing. It was amazing. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Ethan. You were such a big help during that yes. day. Without you, our day wouldn't have gone as well. How about from the beginning? So, our ceremony was supposed to start at 4 p.m. But then we decided since we didn't do a wedding photo shoot, we thought it's great to do a photo shoot before the ceremony. Girls are getting ready starting at 9 a.m. in the morning to do a first look photo shoot at 2 p.m. That was our goal. Mm. And there were so many girls. I have one maternal owner and three bridesmaids and the moms and Alvin's sister. So we got there very early. Get, get ready. The makeup artist there. And I was like, okay, it's a great start. Uh -huh. Let's do this. It's a big day. Turns out that our hairstylist didn't show up. So Suzu really called me. She's like, babe, the hairstylist didn't show up. Meanwhile, I was walking Harper. Harper was literally taking a poop. I felt so bad at that moment because I wanted to be there for you. Yeah, the thing is, he's supposed to be there at 9 a.m. as well to get ready for the girls. Mm -hmm. And at 9.30, the makeup artist said, like, I can't contact him. Like, he's not answering my phone. He's not reading my message. I don't know what he's doing. The day before, I only slept one hour. Wow. Like, I would say an hour and a half only because I was writing my vow and I was also nervous and I, the day before I was coughing because of the AC mm -hmm. and I did not want to cough during the wedding so I was like stressing out, nervous and everything so I didn't have enough, enough sleep and now the makeup artist is telling me that hairstyle is not coming I was like, my wedding is done, <laughs> this is it, I'm gonna do my hair just like I woke up and that's it and it was like already 10 a.m. I was like crying, calling up we gotta cancel this thing. <laughs> I can't do my wedding with the weirdest hair ever. Oh my goodness. And realize, okay, let me call my friend who is also a hairstylist and I also invited her to a wedding. And I call her crying saying, <laughs> hairstylist didn't show up can you please come asap and she she just woke up at the time and she's like yes i'm coming i'm coming <laughs> i was like thank you so much <laughs> seriously misa saved our wedding yeah. the moment she enters our room there is literally a light behind her and i was like oh <laughs> kind of and i was like thank you so much <laughs> but we made it yeah we made it well for my end <clears throat> I got there 12. Literally the only thing that I had to do was wake up. I had a great sleep the night before, <laughs> by the way. I was like sleeping on this big ass bed by myself with Harper. <laughs> it was great. The only hard part for me was literally finding parking. And then I got to the place. I started writing down my vows on a piece of paper <laughs> and I got ready within 10 minutes. The difference, everyone. Yeah, like, the difference. You got ready in 10 minutes. Meanwhile, it took us like five, six hours. Yeah. All I, girls to get ready. Susie was like, do you want to do makeup? I was like, no, why? I was like, look at this beautiful face. <laughs> It's already beautiful. <laughs> All right. But the hairstylist ended up showing up at like 12 or 12.30, but he didn't say anything. He did not apologize to us at all. He was gonna... very unprofessional. Right. The thing is, wedding in Japan, everyone is there. On the on the facility, they have everybody makeup hairstyles. Here, we have to hire everybody individually. Okay, so let's get on with the photo shoot. 
So the photo shoot was really, really cool. Before that, we had the first reveal. We were in like a terrace mm -hmm. and I was looking away. It's very like picturesque. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, is she here? I could hear her footsteps. <laughs> I could hear people cheering. I could hear people saying, woo in the back. <laughs> and then like, I turn around and it was Suzu. Like she was like, oh my God, she was crying. I wanted to cry so bad, but because of all the shock and everything, I didn't cry. And I was like, oh my God. Who is this beautiful person in front of me, right? <laughs> the, the dress that she picked was amazing. It fit her perfectly. Everybody had compliments on it. Yeah, it was oh, it was a great, that. great choice, baby. Your body yeah. was so small. <laughs> Very small. But, Chochi -san. Chochi -san. Yeah. Yeah. Before the first look, I got so nervous because you know I wanted him to like the dress. I wanted him to like the way we looked because he couldn't see me before the reveal. And I just started to get so nervous. I was like, Oh my god, I'm, I think I'm crying. <laughs> and she's like, No, don't cry. Your makeup is gonna get ruined. And I was like, Okay, let's think about something else. And then we started saying, Uncle, Uncle, Uncle. You're so and I was just, like trying not to like. I cry to like mess up my makeup but then I ended up like you know tearing a little bit because I haven't seen him for like two days or only two days I know I know <laughs> but then I really want him to be impressed about my look so I was I was super <clears throat> impressed you and your bridal party looked amazing <clears throat> they are yeah. so pretty oh my god oh, I love them <laughs> and then the funny part was like we opened up a bottle of champagne <laughs> so one of her bridesmaids Car Carolina <laughs> Opened the champagne, like popped it, mm -hmm. and the cork hit somebody on the head. No, I thought it's just a drip. No, the cork. Are you serious? <laughs> I feel so bad, but it's okay. They will understand. That was from a ninth floor of a building in the city. It was, it was crazy. Oh my god. Yeah. So then we, you know, we did, we did some pictures on the <clears throat> terrace, and then we took pictures with the ice bar. Amazing. Oh my god. Ice bar. Shout out to Okamoto Studios. <laughs> oh my and God. flowers by Khan because it's so beautiful. The ice bar was amazing. amazing. But then we went down to Fifth Ave by St. Patrick's Cathedral mm -hmm. and we took amazing pictures. Cheap. Yeah, so people were like clapping, looking, we were crossing yeah. up it's and like, down the street. Congrats. Thankfully the pictures came out amazing. I know. There's this one shot that we really, really love of me, of us in the middle of the street. And I was like holding Suzu. She looks so pretty. I felt like I was just the background or like the extra. What? Because no. it was literally your day. day. You look <laughs> gorgeous. You look amazing. But yeah, so we took pictures and then we walked back up to our little place. Oh and then, God. yeah, we got ready for the ceremony. The ceremony was amazing, by the way. The flowers? I was like speechless for a moment because that was exactly what I wanted. Mm -hmm. It wasn't very traditional, but it was very... It's modern. It's modern, simple, mm -hmm. simple and, and elegant. Elegant. And it smelled amazing. <laughs> I had my mom next to me, walk down the aisle. I was crying again because I saw my friend crying, looking at me. <laughs> but then I can't cry because I don't want to ruin my makeup. It was waterproof, but then, you know, still was like... <laughs> I was like, don't cry, don't cry. <laughs> when you were coming down, my mom was telling me not to laugh, like not to keep laughing, but like, I was just so happy that I was smiling a lot and like laughing. <laughs> and also because my groomsmen were wearing suspenders. Mm. So a lot of them were like, kind of holding their hands like this because the, the suspenders were making their, their pants, pants round. <laughs> so I did not know that. <laughs> My cousin did our officiating. She did an amazing job. Mm. She made it the way we wanted it to be. She made it fun. Like, Not you know, too serious. Yeah, relatable. Just because we didn't want the thing to be super emotional. We didn't want our guests to feel boring or yeah. like space out. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, we, you know, do our, did our vows. <laughs> I had a very short vow compared to Cezu, and I felt like the entire time she was talking, I was like. Damn, I should have I should have made my vow a little bit longer. Jesus. Why was so long? I didn't I didn't feel like it. Like when I was like writing, there was like so much that I wanted to say. I tried to make it as simple, as funny, as quick as possible. And then Harper brought our Harper rings. Harper was a ring bearer. It was so, so cute. cute. <laughs> oh my god. Her being at the wedding was probably one of the most expensive things ever. <laughs> but it was all worth it because we got to spend our special day. Yes, with our but, but thank God she just like walked straight to us. No, she almost stopped. But because like, of the petals. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. She was like, what is this? Can I, I eat this? I know. <laughs> it was so cute. Okay. And then after the ceremony, mm -hmm. we went to the cocktail hour. 
So next is the cocktail hour. So basically mm -hmm. the cocktail hour is like where everybody kind of goes after the ceremony mm -hmm. just to eat like hors d'oeuvres and mm -hmm. like drink. We get to talk actually. Yeah, we get and to take talk. take pictures. <laughs> take pictures with like our guests. Very nice and very mm -hmm. casual setting. Like sometimes that's the time that the bride and groom take to do photos. Mm -hmm. But we were like, we're spending all this money for food. <laughs> we better be able to eat it. So I only ate like three finger food. Really? Yeah. Oh my God, the food was amazing. Uh, so amazing. Suzu got down to the cocktail hour first and I got there later, right? The moment I got to the cocktail hour, I went straight to the carving station. <laughs> I got some steak, I got some salmon, and I was happy. It was great. And then, yeah, every time I found the scalloped thing that she liked, I would get it for her and like, <laughs> like I would Suzu, go like, Suzu, eat! Because <laughs> he knows that if he doesn't feed me, I wouldn't eat at all. Yeah. Because I was like, I'll let her talk to our guest. Enjoy the moment. Mm. Instead of like eating. It was so fun. It was great. We had a lot of pictures. So fun. Open bar. My dad got lit. Uh, <laughs> really? Yeah, he drank so much. Love that. <laughs> it went so quick. Oh, I miss those lamb chops. I never really liked <laughs> lamb until those damn lamb chops were so I good. I didn't get to eat it. And then, yeah, after this cocktail hour, we did the reception. The reception is where everybody gets to sit. You know, we do our first dance and oh eat and all that stuff. And the first dance, our, my best friend, my metronome owner, sang a live song for mm -hmm. us mm -hmm. and it was so pretty. It was great. It was great. I was like a little shy to dance in front of it, like more mm -hmm. like sway, but. The funny part is when we were walking to the reception, I, I forgot that I had my mask on. <laughs> so I had my mask on for like the first part and then like somebody said, Alvin, your mask. And that's the first dance. I took a dance with my mom. Oh. And then, you know, my mom was like, like you know, are you gonna are you gonna take Suzu's mom for a dance? I was like, yeah. And she was like, you better take her for a dance. <laughs> so after dancing with my mom for like a minute, I let her go and I took Suzu's mom for a dance. And like Suzu, Suzu was like, eh, eh, eh. And like her mom <laughs> was, was like, what? what? Yeah, and then like apparently people started crying. I was it. crying. <laughs> my heart like thank you for doing that yeah and thank you for alvin's mom for giving that idea because mm. i didn't know <laughs> yeah it was great my mom is super awesome the entire reception was just like a blur to me because it was like sitting down getting back up doing things like dancing eating mingling <laughs> doing the same thing over again but yeah it was really really yeah fun. it was all about dance 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 <laughs> drink 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 eat 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 oh my god how and many take pictures how many <laughs> shots did we take i probably took like about <laughs> six shots of like tequila maybe oh. there's a one time like unknown shots they were serving i was like i don't know what it is but i just like drink it anyways fun yeah the flowers look amazing <clears throat> flower was amazing the ice sculpture was amazing mm -hmm. the photo booth was great mm -hmm. food was amazing again food. we forgot something oh, what wedding cake oh yes the wedding cake it's so pretty what the heck yes our wedding cake was specially made I don't know if you guys know, but if you're in New York and you like donuts, you probably heard of the company Cora. They're like Filipino inspired donuts that has like a 5,000 long waiting list, right? It's crazy. Good thing is we know like one of the owners of the company. So we are like, hey, can you make us a cake? And she was amazing. We gave her like the ideas and she was like, bet, I got you, mm -hmm. right? Literally when I saw the cake, I was like, oh my God, this was perfect. And the best part was mm -hmm. the taste was so good. It was like, amazing. So good. It was like the first bite that yeah. we had. It was like, yeah, it's so good. We had mangoes in there. I've never had mangoes in a cake like that. We got three tier. Like two tiers are mm -hmm. cream and mango. The mid tier was chocolate. I didn't get to eat the mid tier. Oh really? I saw the cake and I like went out to take pictures and come back. It was gone. Like really? Yeah. And then it was like, I ate. I, I was it. eating my cake. I was like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get to eat. Oh, it's great. Let's do the wedding again. Just kidding. <laughs> Never again. <laughs> Overall, it was amazing. No regrets, but. I will never ever do wedding ever again. <laughs> See? That means she's stuck with me forever. She's not planning on getting divorced. <laughs> That wedding, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. I really hope the guests enjoyed as well because that's all that matters for us. Mm -hmm. Everyone, we hope you enjoyed our wedding, <laughs> us talking about it. <laughs> Sorry we got like super energetic yeah. and emotional about it. <laughs> going forward, it'll be like more of our regular videos because I don't think we're gonna do something <laughs> this big again. As usual, folks, if you like this video, please like. And subscribe. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.